Hello everybody. Welcome to Best Indian Foods. Today we are going to see how to make chicken tikka dry recipe. So this we are going to prepare in the oven. First we will see what are all the ingredients that are required for this recipe. So I have taken curd, a teaspoon of chili powder, half a teaspoon of turmeric powder, half a teaspoon of uh, uh, garam masala and then uh, one teaspoon of um, coriander powder, uh, half a lemon and a couple of uh, um, capsicum. Um, and then I have got chicken thigh uh, which need to be cut into small pieces. Um, so and then required salt. So we will see how to make it. So first uh, mix the curd with all the masala powders uh, with the uh, ginger garlic paste and coriander um, and put them um, in a bowl and then mix them very well and also add the salt as well. Uh, so once you mix start mixing everything so it should have a, a consistent um, dough like uh, consistency um, so and then mix it well. So, so you, you have added uh, the chilli powder for spiciness and also you have added salt um, and the curd as well. So now uh, once this is ready we will be adding the onion and also the capsicums to it. So if as you can see uh, I have actually cut the onions and capsicums a little bit bigger because it's going to be a tikka. So we're going to use the skewers and also make this tikka. So make sure don't do not cut them into so, two small pieces. Uh, so it will be a bit hard to put in, in the skewers. So cut them in the medium sized uh, cubes and then mix them well. So as you can see, so it's mixed very well with the masala. So once you have mixed the vegetables, then uh, take the chicken which has been cut into small pieces. Uh, mix that as well, well in the uh, masala, in the same masala. Uh, so once you have mixed this, um, it should be looking like this. So um, make sure all the pieces of chicken has some masala to it. Um, and then uh, leave it for a few minutes for it to be um, rested so that the masala is sticking very well in the uh, chicken and the vegetables. Um, so once this batter or once this uh, chicken is ready with the masala um, so, um, then we can start process of um, getting them into um, skewers. So uh, well, a small tip uh, about the skewers is just uh, dip them in the water before for 5-10 minutes so that it doesn't get burnt and then um, you can just take one skewer at a time and then start um, skewing them in there so um, mix them well so I'm just putting one chicken and then one uh, onion and then another chicken and then one capsicum so make this skewers with full of chicken and vegetables very well mixed and also keep them in an aluminium foil uh, and also leave enough space between each other because it will have its own juices so don't put them too tight um, so once you have all uh, set this up so now we can actually put these in the oven uh, so I just uh, used a half a kg of chicken so uh, this will serve for uh, two people uh, so if you are uh, having um, uh, more than two people then you can uh, use more chicken which is double the amount and then so once you keep this in uh, oven for um, 30 minutes in 230 degree then uh, our chicken tick then in, in the middle uh, you just need to turn it the other side uh, so once um, you have um, done with the 30 minutes then chicken tikka recipe is ready as you can see it's really good and it has it is very juicy as well uh, try this recipe and also give your comments subscribe to our channel thank you